I, I don't think we'll ever have another Pacquiao though. He's one, he's, he's one of the kind. Yeah, you know, uh, he's just um, uh, one of the best, best persons I've ever trained. He's nice, just a very nice guy. And, uh, you know, it's, um, um, it's, uh, if I retired today, I'd be the person I work with because I know Manny Pacquiao. Well, what would you want to say to him today? Uh, just congratulations and uh, good luck in the, in, in the race for the presidency. And I know you're going to be a great president. Um, dude, and I know you've got a lot of Mark who looked really good in his last fight, and you've you got a few other guys training here. Do you think you will ever find another Manny Pacquiao? Mm, that's going to be really, really hard to say because there's only one Manny Pacquiao. Because, you know, Mark Messiah is a big puncher, and uh, he, he looks like the closest thing at this point, but again, uh, I, I don't think we'll ever have another Pacquiao, though. He's one, he's, he's one of the kind. You think part of it was the things he did outside the ring, beyond the score, the, the way he went so global with it versus just being a fighter? Yeah, he just the, the things he did outside the ring and the things he did inside the ring. I, mean, I have some great, great memories of uh, good times, good, good times, bad times, and uh, just, uh, you know, the world. And I know the Philippines pretty well now, and I've been, I've been, uh, I've been in storms in the Philippines, I've been in nice weather in the Philippines, white sand beaches, and, uh, and then, uh, you know, uh, bad, 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 bad hurricanes. So, I just, um, I know a lot more about the Philippines and uh, about, about life, actually. And of course, uh, a lot of people, especially in boxing, people will retire. I mean, many of you have retired and unretired in the six months. Six months span at one point. Um, what was it about the speech that kind of made you think this is really it? Well, you know, I, I, I know he, you know, he had a big decision to make about, you know, uh, running for president. And, uh, you know, I don't think he, uh, he could be a fighter and run for president at the same time. It, would, it wouldn't be fair to, to, to himself. And is, uh, this gives him a good chance of becoming the president. I, I, I know he's going to do a great job. It's amazing how, uh, how, much, uh, how much love my dad gets, you know. Uh, sometimes I think about it and it's like, you know, it's kind of like uh, it's, uh, overwhelming. Like, you know, it's kind of cool, you know, like, wow, that's, that's my dad, he did this. And uh, yeah, man, I'm happy. A lot, I have a lot of friends messaging me also that uh, the, they enjoyed uh, my dad's career and they said thank you. You didn't know beforehand he was going to do this. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, that's why. You're surprised. I was shocked, you know. And my, my cousin started sending me the videos, the posts, and yeah, that's why. So it really meant a sense of relief when, you, when the family saw it here together. Uh -huh. Yeah, you know, uh, he's finally uh, retired, you know. He be, I mean, he's moving on to bigger things now. Thank you so much for watching this video. And make sure to subscribe for more videos of your favorite fighters over here on Fight Up TV. And give us a follow online as well at Fight Up TV, on Twitter, and on Instagram. We appreciate it, guys.